Hey guys, this is just a short video we're making for our friends and family to update you on our latest news. As many of you know, as a family we are preparing to move to live and work in... Nicaragua! That's right, yes, we're moving to Nicaragua to live there for about five years, working for Engineering Ministries International, a wonderful Christian NGO that helps people in lots of different ways through building hospitals, schools, churches, amongst other things. A recent example of a project happening in the Nicaragua office was with Testeros de Dios, who help children with special needs who are massively oversubscribed. They've helped develop their facilities there, uh, allowing far more children to receive care, having a huge impact on the lives of hundreds of families, both now and for many years to come. So we've been making some good progress. We had a great orientation at the beginning of July where we learned a lot more about what it would be like to live and work in a different culture. And we have been making good progress with our uh, medicals and other assessments and tests that we've needed to do. And uh, you'll be pleased to know that we're both fit and well and good to go. Well, we've been really encouraged by all of the feedback we've had from so many of you and, uh, and all the real generous support we've received as well. We're excited to say that we're just over a third of the way there on both our mobilisation target funding costs and our monthly ongoing support costs. Uh, we need to get to 80% by the end of November and, and we've got our own internal deadline of wanting to get to 60% by the end of October. So the most important thing is that um, we've got lots of people continuing to pray for us as we prepare to go. Um, in terms of prayer points, we'd really appreciate your prayers for the children as they um, get their head around the idea of moving and um, transitioning into another country. Please pray for our flat, which we are trying to let out whilst we're away. That's got some complications uh, to do with it being a, a new build and the changes in the regulation on cladding in recent months. And also, finally, if you could pray for our ongoing um, financial support. Um, we are, as Rob said, making good progress, but we still need more. So please pray that um, that would be provided. If you want to find out any more about what we're up to, we have got a website, uh, emi-quails.com. Uh, or if you've got any questions, do please email us at quails emi at gmail.com hopefully both of these are on the, the screen now that's all i need for now i'll give you an update soon bye, bye.